So for question 20, we're going to integrate x from x dx. So they say show. We need to show in terms of answer like this. So we cannot press calculator. And then showing means our working is very important. So integrate log. So we refresh back by looking at our formula. When we want to integrate, we don't have integrate log. Yeah? Uh, we don't have any integrate log. Answer log got. Uh, integrate fraction, answer is log. But we don't have integrate log. So when we meet the question, integrate log means we need to uh, focus to our technique technique of integration. So we can see uh, our question here is x long x. So linear with logarithm. So we can use our uh, integration by part because this is two missing, uh, two combining function. So we perform our integration by part. So for finding our integration by part, we have to find which is u and which part is dv. Okay, we have to define our questions here, which part is u, the rest of it will become dv. So when you want to find u, we follow our constant of priority of log back. So log will be the first priority. Log function will be log the first priority. So u will become log x, log log x. Then when we differentiate u with respect to x, it will become sunny is simple, differentiate near the atas, thing as two. So from u, we must manage to obtain what is your du. Du, move your dx to the right hand side. So 1 over x dx. Meanwhile, for v, dv here, it will be remaining of your part. So you can see once of your long x already taken as u, the remaining part is x dx. So don't forget your dx. So for this dv part, we're going to integrate both sides so that we can get v. For integrate x, power plus 1 over new power. So we won't plus c yet, okay, because we haven't finished. This is just one part only. Okay, so finding out our v and then finding out our du. So from our questions, integrate 1 e x long x dx. Integrate u dv equals to u v. Okay, u v minus v du. So in the red V, du, du is 1 over x, dx. Because this one is defined in the group, so we have to put our limit. For this part, for this part, uv part, they already uh, done their integration. So this part, we have to put our limit, which is upper limit E, lower limit is 1. So this one heaven, we follow the limit. So what we can do now is we will integrate the part at the part at the uh, behind here, the second term there. So at the same time we can substitute this. So substitute this e squared over two, then ln e minus one squared over two ln one minus integrate one e. So here, after we simplify, you will get x. So 1 over 2, I factorize out. So long e, simplify. So at the same time, in front here, we simplify. At the same time, at the back here, we integrate. So long e, we get 1. Here, we get e squared over 2. Long 1, we get 0. So move, at, move to the part at the back here, we integrate x. We get x squared over 2. Upper limit is e, lower limit is 1. Okay, so this one will be e squared over 2 minus 1 over 2. So we have to simplify until the format there asks us to find 1 over 4. So 1 over 2 e square minus 1 over 4 e square. 
it will give us 1 over 4 e square plus 1 over 4. Look at our answer 1 over 4 catalyzed. Then e square plus 1. Rearrange, which is 1 plus e square. So, so integration by part, the first part, selecting your U and the many is DB. So then that will be your concept. Answer finding the U and V. Then put in your formula, integration by part formula. And start integrate the part at the back here. So finally, we simplify until we get the format, get the answer that the question asks us to find.